Yo, oh boy, what's going on, people? Okay. Just did a review. Team Charlotte Motorsports of a 2016 Yamaha R1M. She got a booty on her. Now I'm going to take my butt right around, give you my impressions and what, two, three months ownership of the Gold Wing 2019. And no, I'm not at Bike Week because I went to Key West. Bike Week is trivial uh, condo paid for no car payment oh and I'm a ride I don't know where the hell I'm going yes yeah, so I'm gonna put this bitch in sport mode yes I am weekend good hope this be uploaded tonight when I park it I should not be out here in this hot ass sun I know that much that's why I got the windshield on that doesn't that goes down now I forget sometimes this thing actually sets itself up automatically I'm like, why are you going up because uh, I didn't change the shit Purple. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Got suspension good. I just came from Key West. I'm sorry that I did not film anything. It was a sort of kind of vacation, and I'm not trying to sit there and pull over and mess around and change batteries in the GoPro all day. Because you know, GoPro batteries suck. But you know, I hope this thing working now. So, get my assessment of the Wing. Um, if I go to California. I will need another seat. But as far as tank to tank riding, I'm pretty good with it. If you are going through Georgia and South Carolina in a straight line, prepare to have some blisters. Well, I will. But it was ex 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 exceptionally hot going down there. But when I came back, it was like humid, which is fine, I can sweat. But going. Hour trip. 16 hour trip. 
it hurt me. Not gonna go in. Not gonna go in at all. The stop and the distance and stuff like that. And I lack of turning this joke on a dime and you know, getting it in when I want to. Because I was the designated the road captain. And I'm not even in a club at the moment. weekend in Charlotte is one of them days or one of them weekends, not more than a holiday, more than weekend. You at the beach. Since I rode up Key West and I enjoyed myself immensely, I decided to go on Key West, I mean, Myrtle Beach. Simply because of one reason. Why? And then I heard this year ain't no really going on. Somebody else, a class action lawsuit, the place where we used to park it was the Horizon in North Myrtle. They sort of like turned into a timeshare and they had 100% security at the lower level. What happened was, I don't know what happened, but all I know, that's what I heard, and that's terrible because that's a good ass place to stay. If you ride a bike, you park it down lower levels and you're fine. But it broke my heart. And plus, I want to save my money for my vacation days all the time. I use sport mode when I'm around driving through traffic, so because I can downshift like a sport bike, engine brake is good. I can turn it while I'm downshifting. ABS is well done, and uh, I don't have no problem. Pretty girl, too big up. So I was gonna do another sport bike for you, but I was like, nah, get the wing. I do it once every Friday. If y'all want to see that, I'll do a sport bike review. I think on my next one will probably be a ZX10. They got some good, pretty good deals at Team Charles. You know, get on the website, just call them up. Uh, the Suzuki is 1,000, 2017 models that are in, uh, well, that was leftovers that nobody bought. They're monsters. Hey, if you don't believe me, look at MotoGP, even though they don't really, not the same bike. But trust, they did a good job with that thing. They sold them to for $9,600. time giggles for me to get the hell out down the road, I get on down the road. State trooper cop asked me, why you going to pass me? Because these fuckers are crazy. Hell, I got a GoPro room, like tell people sitting there on the phone texting. I mean, I seen a person using a damn iPad. Well, what the hell is that? You a CEO, you should have a driver. Anyway, I digress. And this new that you don't see is hot. See, she on the phone, but she on the phone. On the screen. Anyway, this thing's still recording. I think it is. I'm going down here to the BMW shop just to drink some uh, liquid. I know they're trying to feed people. I'm not doing that. They'll see if, I, okay, back to my original. I mean, I am trying to figure out do I want the right lane, left lane, uh, big deal. Ooh. So, suspension can handle it. Do I want. I sold my Prilla to get this. A BMW S1000, uh, 2020, the 2020 model, which they will have it in the showroom, probably about two months. It's gonna be a first generation, don't worry about that. Uh, the Ducati V4, the base model Ducati, is already 20,000. 
with all them damn recalls on your ball and hell of me. If you have recalls on a 2018 model, when your 2019 model comes out, you should not have any recalls. Let's talk about history. All right, man, we're getting front. The history of this is like the ZX-10s, when they first redesigned the ZX-10s before they got the new ones now, it's about like 2000, the 2011 models, they, the rear back of the engines had pores, was pores, so it leaked oil. They bought them all back. They said, nope, nah, uh-uh, no engine recall. Engine swap it, or we can buy them all back. They bought all of them back, well, engine swap. Very good thing. 2012 came up, no problems. I bought a 2012, black and red, with a two pearls of pipe on the thing, and I thought it was the greatest bike ever because it was really slim. The new ones now, they too fat for me. I'm not messing with them. I don't care how much power they got, or whatever, they too fat. You went the back, you went backwards. You had a skinny one, and then you went to a fat one. R1, new ones, 2015 models. First, second gear, I think it was first gear had messed up. They had to crack over the engine case. They, get, they give the owners no problems. We can swap out the engine, swap it, open the case up, and I know personally, I know some people just said, no, we'll wait till next generation. Or they got a new engine, which will work, custom service. That's when you're on the bike, dude. You can't be having problems. Let's see. I think the Concourse, they came out, they had the, uh, um, what's that thing, the change is no problem, but it was somebody made a CTE, or somebody made an aftermarket change system. They had fixed it right up, no problem. Then he had a red recall, but they will fix it for you. They did fix it for swap them out, better one. Honda, Honda having problems all day. I, I'm not trusting the 1000 no more. 2008 model, when they came out nice and slim, they were burning oil. Before you got the 3000 service miles, you had like a drop of oil that day. Now, when they try to do the electronics on it. I mean, you killing MotoGP. You got money to find. You better take some of them millions and put in your damn sport bike, dog. For real, Honda. Going. We have problems with the going. But, you know, get enough people complain about them. They'll change it. Well, they didn't change this latch. All I got was two key fobs. I need to update that system. But I'm not problem with it because the, the key components, the brakes, the engine, and the transmission are fine. You this engine and the trans transmission is perfect. It ain't nothing wrong with this joke. So I have nothing to complain about. They said paint job. Do I really care about the paint? It's going to be sitting outside for the longest time. If, if I first bought it had a paint job problem, yeah. Five years down the road, I give zero fucks. But the paint job should have last though. What else? We got Suzuki. Well, people ain't really been buying Suzuki because they ain't been really doing it with them. So the new ones came out, the new ones are bad. They have no problem with them. That I know of. I didn't really research it, but I don't think the new Suzuki from the 17 models that came out had any problems. I'm kind of mad at Yamaha because they didn't put the quick shift up in that uh, auto blue quick shift. When I, I bought my 17, had a quick shift up. 18 is a quick shift up and down. That's wrong. Just pack all of it in so you don't call, call it a day. Yes, I am. And you know it. So, I would say the wind feels good right now, but it's kind of hot. And, you know, I'm kind of glad the story got on the parents. Ducati, let's talk about Ducati, the V4 when it came out. Five recalls. We had the engine cooler recall at Lake. I think the brake right brake right, 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 reservoir. Uh, gas leaking, I believe. I believe the gas was leaking on it. Uh, something else. It was slow up somewhere. Somebody said they had a problem with the storm. But I do, I seriously do, out of all the bikes I mentioned, I know. The BMW I might want to get like next year after they go through all the new. It's a 2020 model, but I'll probably buy one in 2020. That's made in 2020. Not made in 2019, and you call it 2020. Like, let everybody get all the kinks out of it, or you will look at it. Because people are like, oh, it's underwhelmed. No, 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 it's a BMW. They really did a good job. I like the looks of that joke. And I, when you come to a, a premium, buy, premium expensive bike, you got to look at the warranty on the jokes. Ducat is two years. Aprilla, two years. You can buy some Aprilla parts like that damn racing ECU I put on my old bike. And it don't go with it. I was like, really? It don't go with it? No. Okay then, mate. I will buy it. Which is funny to me. Oh, he needs turns. Get it out of the Yep. Okay. I'm going to stop this video when I park it. So I'll probably continue when I get back. I'm gonna check the battery level and everything. And I'm down here to look at it to see the V4s and all that. I don't want to test it right, it's hot as hell. 
And the heat issue with the Ducatis. I really don't care. Well, I do. I do care. I ain't gonna lie about this shit. I always care about heat issues. My R1 was hot, but I didn't care. Because I never went, like, town to town on that bitch. It was dumb. I guess I'll stop it right here. Look at that thing. Pretty golly. Another thing about motorcycles and cars, especially cars too. If you mess around and go to a dealership, cars or bikes, whatever, and you see a lot of them in the back getting worked on, there's a problem. Somebody who sold cars for like 500 years told me about that shit. I was like, really? Yeah, it's a problem with it. But you know, it's about that life. But it kind of will fix whatever the problem with it. That's one thing I do know. Warranty issues or whatever. That's why two years you gotta. But it's like get to the point where they being slick. You're breaking my heart. Don't do that. Make sure this thing is off. All right. Half battery. 60 minutes. I'll see y'all in a minute. All right. Up and rolling now. Had a nice little chat with the BMW down here. Ducati Triumph of Charlotte. I think I might test ride a Ducati V4 Tuesday. I'm trying to get the 411 of them BMWs. And the motherfuckers are buying them jokers, which I wouldn't blame them. No, I gotta decide which one I want. Hell, my crazy ass might get extra job and get both. Then I had to give a kidney up or something. Know what I'm saying? I don't think it broke in. I 
out of the 600 mile break-in period, they got two years under the mile warranty. BMW looking kind of good. And not to mention them damn the, 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 uh, turn signals. Them turn signals now, oh no. Not turn signals, but the, the, the real lights. You can spend 19, 20 grand. Y'all need to do something with it. So, okay, now I'm doing 60 percent toward the BMW. That's it. 
I rather like the performance left and right of the bike and the longevity of the engine than anything else right about now. Because your bikes get expensive. The 09 R1 was like 13,000. My 09, yeah, 09 R1 was about 13,000. Uh, yeah, the Concourse, the Alto Concourse in 2009 was 135. Now everything is fifteen, sixty thousand dollars, which they don't understand. Ain't nobody about that life. They ain't trying to hit that shit. And on the one thing, you trying to hit shit. Right here. So, Stubway, no sport tour. Got an eight hundred pound bike with sport mode on this thing, and it works. And you know it ain't. Everybody doing, everybody who ride, everybody who has a gold wing, everybody who have a gold wing, everybody who want one, everybody who don't want one. Even you're a hard to ride, how you doing? Just want to say hello. How you doing? Did they open the ambush shot and stuff? Because they look, we was going from right lane all the way to left lane. I'm going to do this next right here. Tap, tap, down, forth again. Look at that, no dip. Name trucks. What are they saying? Oh, they ain't vacation. Do, 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 do. I'm getting better at filming because I am no longer I know now. Yeah, 3,000 RPM. Yeah. So I am no longer I, I am cognizant of the GoPro being on now. So I'm sitting with my hand talking to me. And I was weird, I was weird about it. Having a conversation with yourself on YouTube is funny. Because you're not used to you see people do it. Oh, then we we'll get a shout out to Cooling with Jay at you on YouTube. Cooling with Jay, he has the, he's the first owner of a Ducati V4. I contacted him on Instagram. I meant to do this a long time ago. I contacted him on Instagram, and he gave me what I need to actually start my own YouTube channel. As far as, as advice, advice from sound. You want to check him out? He do gaming, he work out. He do gaming a lot too, uh, and he has a Ducati. So if you're interested in Ducati and the big falls of it and the good things about it, you might want to check him out and ask him questions on Instagram too. Uh, it's Cooling with J. Uh, Instagram. I think it's Cooling underscore with underscore J. J. I mean, black guy, young, younger than me. Oh, a lot younger. I'm 46. I'm, not, I'm over the hill. I got my, uh, what's the thing called? I got my, uh, what is it? What's the thing called? We get, like, midlife price. I got that shit done at 31 when I bought my first one. I got over there. <laughs> we going through your midlife price? Your midlife price is when you buying 13 motorcycles in 10 years. When you buy them, have fun with them, and you trade them off for a better one, you always good thing. That's what I've been doing. So, yes, yeah, so I got a lot, had a lot of bikes. So would I keep them? No, I'm not 650E. I'm not about that life. Not especially when nothing or something better come up. No, I didn't do that thing. But the one thing though, I kick this corner. I'm gonna motor GP this thing. Mm -hmm. Yup. So I get the damn limit on <laughs> Easy. See that? Watch this. I would set it up all the way up, two up with luggage so it would raise up to the highest level. And then when I do that, I'm still recording. Yeah. And when I do that, it gets, and you can turn it. I mean, you can turn the hell out of it, Joe. I do like the performance of this gold wing. Open up my shield a little bit because it's hot. 
go home and work, work, work around the house, get out the doghouse, enjoy my life. See if I can get me some fried pork chops. I'm gonna have to do workout, dog, for real. My brother took a video with me. I might put it on, on YouTube too. Oh, I had the shirt, just a shirt. And we was going out of Key West with hats on. I have a, bought me a Honda hat in West Palm Beach. Had it turned around, chilling. And I noticed something. I'm fat as fuck. Yes, I said it. I got titties, I got a stomach. And when you look, you don't see yourself too much. You know, we're gonna be, oh yeah, I gained some weight. Bitch, I'm like 40 pounds overweight. I'm gonna use it under 200. I always been skinny all my life, but I'm big as hell. I mean, big as all. When you can get on a sport bike and your stomach touch the tank, that's a problem. Yeah, see, so he's playing around, see him? Yeah, back to my weight. I'm fat. So I'm I'm in six gear going in. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but I'm not really caring. Fall this over the block, put it back in the garage. I could ride all day on this thing. Oh, I'm at 3902. Well it's time to get up with change. But I don't think I'm gonna do it. I gotta have key west. Not key west, but drag itself in my mess. Oh, first gear. Blood. There's a policeman over there. Bike. Don't play with me. You better have a conventional fork system. What is that? Oh. <laughs> I thought it was a gay girl. A gay dude. A gay a dude with just, well, he put this little thing left on. Which I needed it. Also. I guess I was a sit like this. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Ah. Good puppy. Good puppy. A jacuzzi with ice in it. That's what I need right about now. Damn the heat. It's hot. If I had a heart, I don't know. I would take the gloves off and put my half human on. T shirt. I told the guys when I was down in West Palm Beach, it was so damn human. I'll go get me a man thaw. All I need to hold a sack, baby. And some boots and gloves and a hat and a damn hat. That's all I need. I said, you crazy. Let's think about it. Y'all ain't hot yet. Wait to get down to Key West with that humidity. You better drink some water. Damn a beer. Of course, I had a beer. <laughs> but I like one beer. And that T-bone. It wasn't any T-bone. I don't know what kind of steak it was. That shit was nice. Nice. And these fuckers are trying to turn left. It was nice. It was lovely. Nice and thick. It was like an inch steak at a rest seat from a restaurant. I'm looking over the damn pier, seeing sharks. I'm like, bruh. Right about now, your ass get eight. Get back, homie. Think about that life. I will not pay a lot for this. Everybody turn left. Oh, hell no. Go, look. See, this is why motorcycle be doing legal shit. I'm hot as hell, man. Dude, y'all all ain't gonna make it. I, look, this is when you don't give a damn. I'm about to be one of them. I know I ain't got a room on the right side to go down because they paving. It's going to be a big ass ditch on the right side. Now, let me get one of them dang on. Uh, what's some thing called? African Twins. Oh, I'm all in it. The big old bags on it. I'm all in it. Get over there. Hey. Let's 
Somebody is smoking weed. They ain't trying to catch no contact. Drive your ass up in that piece. Y'all just can't turn around right then and fuck. Motherfucking people. If somebody died, I don't care. You're dead. If I die, look, I'm telling you, if I die, don't hold no traffic up. Just drive. If you get caught traffic, it don't matter. Put my ice on, burn me, whatever you need to do. Don't waste nobody time with somebody there. Don't do that. You better turn. I'm going to tell you like this. Bastards. Suck nuts. Intersection. Most dangerous place on the planet. See that car? You don't want that BMW. See, if I still got some more time, yeah, if I go ahead and do a synopsis of the bike and then I'll take it on how I I know it's gonna take like three weeks to upload this joke. Okay, we are going, going too slow for 45 miles per hour. It's 40 miles per hour when you sit down. When it's port mode, baby. Come on, get that hard Hyundai somewhere. She's on the phone, playing with her titties, what you doing? I don't see old boy leaning over sucking on titty. Come on now. Get on down the road, we doggy. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna take it to the park right quick before I take it to the house and I'm gonna uh, do a quick synopsis. I'm gonna check the, the uh, GoPro, see if I got no battery life. It should like, take about five minutes. Same place where I took the R1 earlier. I'm not gonna chop these shit, I'm not gonna put them together. I put the Gold Wing ride together and uh, what's the thing called? The R1 M ride as one. Still going 42 miles per hour in a 45. Yo, you killing me, yo. Come on, Holmes. You go. I know you just didn't stop when you saw that car. But I got turned down here, so anyway, there's not like going to the church. Because I be cussing sometimes, and I'm not trying to go to hell. See the truck up here? You gonna let me go there? Yeah, and I'm gonna find me some J's. Go my little spot. Hope everybody at the beach more that we can have fun. Hope y'all getting some damn wind from the ocean breeze, because if you're not, you go burn the hell up. And if you're drinking, you go pass the hell out and you go crash. Chill out down there, you bastards. It's, it's hot. Lady's like, you got uh, you got this jacket on? No, you hot though, pearl lady. I'm looking at her like you're not about to seal me nothing down here. Trust me, you ain't about to seal me nothing. Ain't about that life. Yeah, let's pick up those pipe. Get out of the damn third. There we go. Rocks. Don't care. I turned the radio down so I won't get demonized, whatever the thing called. But guess what? I give zero. My channel too small. Y'all share this channel. Like, subscribe, please. So I can get some more, um, you know, if I start making money on YouTube, I will be buying a whole lot of motorcycles. I probably gonna be 650 e cup, like because forty thousand dollar motorcycle ain't my thing. That joke is going to a nine 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 two two thousand twenty. Let me check the damn thing. Is it recording? Twenty seven. Yep. Okay. Two thousand nineteen Honda Goldwing Sport Tour. Only thing I got done to this thing was suspension set up, max traction dynamics, max traction dynamics in uh, Woodstock, Georgia. And that, the little, what's that thing called? This right here. You see it? Troll on. That. Um, but it's on myself for Utopia. I've been rocking with Utopia for a minute. I got 3,900 miles on it. Black. I got two key fobs. It's dirty. I just see that now. Everything fine with it. Hope ain't no porn in here. Nope. Battery pack for GoPro. That's it. If you know about Go Wing, you slam the trunk. That way it's closed. I don't care if it's even black plate. Because there ain't nobody coming to my house. I ain't worried about y'all. Unless you come back with a beer or some steak. The strippers. I'm just joking. Sportier than the old ones. I had. 04 Goldwing 
big ones. A blue one with a whole lot of chrome on. I put 3,000 miles on that joke in a month. I went everywhere. At that time, I had I had, was seeing somebody that was in Virginia, but that was that died a long time ago. So I recently ride up there, and then I got caught <laughs> almost snowstorm. Then they they saw the roads. This got covered. I couldn't see through it, so I had to pull over. I hated that. That's why I got rid of it, cause you couldn't rule. The, you got to stop to clean the windshield. Like, what is that? Uh oh, do I see a defect? I don't care. What the hell? All right, now Max, let me come down now. Um, pretty good bike, pretty good touring bike. Reasonable gas miles. You keep it under 85, 80. Say 75. I got a good gas mileage at 75 miles speed limit. So the people who work speed limit know what they're doing. Even though the speed limit was 70, I believe it's 75, hit cruising and just be gone. Even though people pass me like going 1,000 miles per hour in a car, damn minivans. Pretty good bike. I like, is it Womack approved? I would say yes. Oh, yeah. Shout out to the guy, if you ever see this video, that told me when it was at JP Cycles in, I think it's outside of Jacksonville, Florida, north, about wetting of dryer sheets with people most people got them in the house I, I, I just sprayed it this thing was full of bugs um, I sprayed it down just wet it and just put the dryer sheets in the main areas after I did that I took it and wiped it bugs came right off no issues no scratch the paint no nothing now I got more bugs on the course because I've been riding this right here need to come off I get that done um no issues that and that worked you got dry sheets you use about five of them or you can just wet the dry sheets in place I use spray it off first spray it down first uh, just to soak up the goo, which don't work. Of course, everybody know that. And then wipe it down, and I'm good. So, I only did about 2,000, let's see if it's 3,000 something miles on it. I think I had like 25 on it. It's almost time, 100 more miles, it's time for the first service. So, 3,905 miles. I need to update my stuff too, because it don't work. Uh, when I hook up my phone, it always asks me, do I need to enable the CarPlay? It shouldn't do that with a second update, so I'm gonna do that. I'm happy with it. I'm, it's paid off, fuck it. I'm really happy with it. Uh, will my car get in the miles this year? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm gonna start riding this book to work. The thing about riding to work is my job is only like seven miles from where I live at. So riding to work is like, by the time I crank it up, it won't up. It's probably time to. Uh, Put it up. I mean, all around good bike. I, it, it's a people go hate me for this, but I don't care. It is a combination of an old go wing, 2000s, they what, 16, set 15, below, and a Kawasaki Concourse. You take both of them bikes and put them together, this is what you'll get. When should go over now, just like the Concourse, ABS, Trash Patrol, just like the Concourse, even though the Concourse is what, nine, ten years old. Slight updates during the wheel. I got the bug in my head, but oh, I know it ain't no hell because I shake my head ball. Anyway, I don't care. Um, it is that. If you don't like the cargo capacity, I suggest you get an old one or just deal with it. Stop complaining. You know what it is when you bought it. Stop complaining, okay? Oh, Honda, shit, Honda ain't done nothing but put out a product. It's up to you to buy it or not. Stop complaining. I'm 46. Don't have grandkids, don't have it. This is the bike for me, okay? It ain't for the 800 year old people that's, oh, it ain't got this. I'm gonna put wind flex. Trust me, in this kind of heat, you gonna need, you don't want no wind flex. I'm not cutting no holes in my plastic. Now, in that case, if I'm by myself, I ain't got no backrest, or no passenger, or put a rack on it, I'll take me a winter suit <laughs> if I need it. As of right now, it's fine. It's, it's very fine. Let's see if we got a cup on tires. Nope. Tires look good. I ain't hope. Oh, chicken strip. I failed you. And I actually, I, I am treating it like a sport bike though. That's one thing about it. And when I'm on the road, high chilling, unlike you just see me day coming back from dealership and stuff, usually, especially when I'm with people with inferior products. I say that necklace, I just got a bike and I'm feeling myself right there. So don't be offended. So I'm gonna say it again, inferior products. Cause I ain't got that. I ain't got dude. You had an old bike. 
You ain't got Apple CarPlay on it. You had it. You bought it. What? Fourteen. You bought it in 2015. Apple CarPlay just getting out with some cars. Even though I think they need to do Google for Android, but I'm not. I am, I'm not about the Android life. Not yet. Unless they come up with that damn fold, I might give it a try. It's a lot it's more expensive, but hey, I ain't got to worry about buying a tablet. Back to the bike. Yes, I do like it. It don't get hot. I play around it. I can ride this bike in heavy ass traffic and have no problems with it. Sport bike, it's go heat up. This I got. Look at the radio. It ain't even the fan ain't even cut on. But that is about it. Hope you like my videos. I'm kind of weird when I'm riding. It is hot. I'm gonna drink a half gallon of water and probably be, and probably eat a, a pickle. I'm right up the street. And Walmart Michael. Walmart, well, hell, my, my Facebook name is Walmart Michael, my last name first. So if you ever want to frame me, most of my stuff's up there too. I ain't got no problem with friends. You better go away and frame me. Because most of the time, nine times out of ten, I'm going to see you. Man at a dealership, he put the old school arms on it. You want to come out for that? I was like, okay. Instead of putting little nubs on it, the nipples, he put the whole thing. I was like, that shit look good. I didn't bother find a high, but I don't really ride with a pattern too much. So, yeah, I like the bike. Pretty good. Uh, like I said, like and subscribe. I'm going to get on her name, if you want to call her, is Airwolf. Y'all remember that damn 80s and 90s TV show with Jan Michael Vincent and a dude, Ernest Borgnine? This is Airwolf. You can't tell me nothing about it. It's black. It's sexy. It's got electronics when you cut it on. I mean, come on. Look at this thing. Cut thing on. Hit the button. It could right out. And watch this. It'll come up something else. Some about a radio. Stand down. Boop. Cut it off. Radio on. That's Airwolf. 100% Airwolf. You know, it's got a full tank gas in it. And I just messed, I messed around and picked the thing up like with nothing. Still recording? It's 31 minutes. This thing gonna take years to upload. I want to say thank you for viewing. Thank you for watching. If you got jokes, holler at me. Be safe out there wherever you at on the bike. My kick stand up because I'm tired of seeing the thing blink. Um, don't like to go in and get one. Team Charlotte has some 18 models down there trying to give away almost. They got some, I think a red one. If you want one and you don't want to pay the MSRP, go down there and speak to uh, T. Caldwell or uh, Rob Wiley. Or hell, any one of the damn salesmen. Just take it out. Take for, I think they might have some DCT models in there. Your tour or non-tour. So go down there and test them out. I guarantee you'll ask to buy one. Remember, you get 4,000 miles of first service. So by the time you get on it and ride it, you ain't going to be thinking about it. All right? You can forget about your car. Your wife will love it. She will love it. Or she'll become a lesbian when you join your lady. Shout out to everybody. Y'all be safe out there. I'm going home. Take me a shower. Eat a pickle, drink a half gallon of water, and I'm pretty sure I got some housework that I have nothing to do with, but I'm going to do it anyway because I'm going to be cool until this weekend since I rode the Key West. Not my fault. I still got my foot, y'all. I still got my foot. All right, let me see. Yeah, it's about that. I hate when it's down me. It's just like embarrassing. So, peace out. Have a day weekend. Shit, if I had some water right now, I'd light up, make me a burger and drink me a half gallon and sit right in the shade. But these fire ants ain't no joke. Anyway, all right. See y'all later. Peace out. You see, I'm sweating. Okay, bye. Doo -doo 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 -doo.